First of all, welcome to Full Contact Performance Centre. I know uh, some of you train here anyway, some of you don't, but um, even those that you train here, this programme that we're about to go on starting today is like totally different than uh, probably any of you have ever done in your lives. It's a 22 week programme, so we're, we're here to build you, you know, make you not break you. We'll be building up gradually as the weeks go by. The first four weeks we're training Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday's a rest day, and we're in Thursday, Friday, all right? After those four, four weeks, it'll be every morning, Monday to Friday. I own a restaurant and bar. I'm a registered nurse. I'm a coach, or aka personal trainer. I'm 50 years old, grandmother of three. Been through quite a transition in the last couple of years. Uh, separated from my husband. Had some mental health issues. I've now resolved those. I used to play football for Rochdale until I was 18. Unfortunately, I got a bit of a bad injury. It ended my career early. When it comes to fitness, never done anything in my life. I was in the Air Force for 14 years. I'm a father of three, got three girls. I'm a plumber, or oh, heating engineer as an all. I'm a chartered accountant. My motivation really was lifestyle. You know, I've got three beautiful boys and I don't want to be getting into my midlife and having the mid-range spread and you know, not being able to have the fun with them and exercise. Since having my boy three years ago, I've probably slowed down in a lot of areas. Um, I don't use that as an excuse anymore. I've never done any martial arts training before. That was part of the appeal, learning new skills. I've got a kid on the way in January and I just wanted to build up the confidence in myself and also teach my kid new things, new disciplines. And everything that I did was about everybody else and not myself. So this is just for me. It's also good for the people that have hit 50 and think they're past it. Uh, nobody's past it. I'm diabetic, I'm overweight, I'm 50. I don't want to go through the next 20 years being unhealthy. I went to university and put on six stone in two years. Hopefully, getting on this training camp now, everything's going to hopefully turn around for me. I've got five children and I just want them to look up to me for something. Since getting out of the RAF, I've sort of become fat and lazy. I'm getting to, I'm getting to near 30 year old now and it, you know, it, the older you get, the harder something like this becomes. So, so yeah, so let's, let's do it, let's go for it. In, in the past, like five or six different fighters have turned pro after completing the Winter Warrior. So I've seen it as like, um, maybe a once in a lifetime chance. My mum passed away and to be honest ever since she passed away with cancer any challenge that comes along I've decided now that's it you're only here once you've just got to go for it. I'm uh, getting married in the summer so hopefully I can shed a few pounds before then. It's not easy to get yourself, drag yourself out of bed at five o'clock every morning. I'm going to have to be strict with my diet if I want to you know lose the weight that I'm planning to. I stop smoking my diet is horrendous I live on takeaways hopefully at the end of this 22 week I'll be a fitter version of myself. Mentally in my mind I'm already there I'm already a winner in my head but something again in the heart as well. I'm looking forward to just feeling good, feeling fit and feeling like I can deal with anything that life throws at me. I'm as fit as I can before I'm 40. I don't intend on doing the 22 week and then stopping. Exercise obviously helps you as a person with, with, with your mental side of things as well. It makes you feel a lot better. I want to be more confident in my own ability with the confidence within myself to um, smash anything that I come up against. I give up working full time to give this a one year opportunity to see whether I can make it as a, as a, as a professional. I expect to be in the best physical condition of my life. I just want my kids to grow up knowing that this is, you know, you can put yourself through absolutely anything and you can come out a winner at the other side. And just give my body and my mind the um, chance to enjoy the next 20 years. Well, I'm gonna live till longer than 70, but <laughs> the rest of my life.